Welcome to another Bloxels EDU tutorial video, this one about creating your own backgrounds. To get started, we're going to go into the Builder portion of the app and select the Backgrounds portion. So tap on the green icon and you'll be brought to this menu. I'm going to go ahead and open Galaxy because I'm going to make a galaxy. So hit open. You'll notice on the bottom left, I've got some animated art I've created down there. Also on the right, we have our color palette with our different shades and the wheel full of colors. Now to make a background, you're going to use the draw tool. To the left of this toolbar, there's a little bar you can raise or lower, which changes the size of the brush you're going to use. I want to add a planet first, so I'm going to grab this purple color and move that bar all the way to the top to make the biggest circle I can. Remember, if you don't like the color, you can always change it. Now I'm going to grab this art that I created and I'm going to draw with it. Now if you have any animated art when you draw, as you see here, it does different phases of the animation as you go. That looks pretty neat, so I'm going to scatter them all over the place like this. Just click and drag. Now I'm going to add a few stars, I'm going to slide the bar down a little bit, and I'm going to grab this white, and I'm just going to tap in some of the blank spaces to add stars. Then I'm going to make it even smaller and add little speckly stars that are really far away. I'm just going to add these all over the place here. Now remember, if you ever want to undo, erase, copy, paste, fill, or use the grid, you've got this toolbar here. Fill allows you to change the colors of things that are already there. So if I wanted to change my planet to pink, just tap on pink and then tap on the little planet I drew. Then I can change the color of it through the wheel like I could any other thing. I kind of like this darker orange, so we're going to go with that. Now the snap allows you to pull up a grid. Now when you have the grid on, when you draw, it will put your mark inside the center of the square. So say I wanted to draw some stars like this. If I click and drag, you'll notice all of the dots are right in the middle of each segment of the grid. And when you turn the grid off, you can see it without the lines. I'm not sure I like the stars in straight lines, so I'm going to hit the undo button. Now when you're done, make sure you go into the top and name your art. This one's called Galaxy. When you're done, tap on the green mountain on the top, tap on your art, and make sure you share to the class library so your classmates can use your background and you can use theirs. That's going to do it for this tutorial video. Thanks so much for watching. Have fun out there. I'll see you next time.